Today in our 2016 Mitsubishi Outlander, we're doing a test fit of the Kuat NV 2.0 platform style 2 bike rack. That part number is NV22G. Now we already have our bike secured down. We're first going to show you one of the key features of this rack. We're going to pull down on the lever on the side. And that's going to allow us to tilt our bike rack away from our vehicle with our bikes fully loaded. In this position, we're going to gain full access into our back hatch area to get anything in or out that we may need. So what's great about this is that we don't have to worry about taking our whole bike or our bike rack off of our vehicle just to gain that access. Next, we'll lift straight up on our rack, and that locks everything back into place. As for how our bike is secured down, we have a cam buckle strap here at the back. That's quick and easy to remove. And at the front, we have a wheel hook. This either sits in front of our brakes or in front of our frame, depending on how our bike is made. We'll just push the button and lift that up, push it out of the way. Then we can take our bike off of our rack and set it off to the side. We want to make sure to fold our hook back into place, just like so. Now we'll take a few measurements. First is going to be overall, we're going to have about 34 inches added to our vehicle. We're going to have a ground clearance back here of about 20 inches. The closest point is going to be about 10 and 3 quarter inches. And from the center of our hitch pin hole to our closest point, we're going to have about 11 and a quarter inches. Now we do have one more position we can put our rack into. Again, pulling down on our lever there going to lift up and our rack locks into place. Now here on the end if we open up this lever we're actually able to pull out and work on our bike in this position. So our down tube would go just in here that loosens up to fit the down tube and you can work make any repairs or adjustments you need to on the go. We'll take a couple more measurements we're going to have about 17 inches added to our vehicle now and a ground clearance of about 10 and a half inches. Now we're not really going to have to worry about a closest point even if we have a little bit of movement in our rack at all. We have enough space in between our bike rack and our vehicle that we won't have to worry about contact there. As for our hitch, this is designed to work with two inch hitches only. We have a pin and lock holding this in place. That's gonna help prevent theft and tampering. And then here at the back, we have our anti-rattle device. This tightens everything up on the inside of our shank. So we're gonna keep a lot of that shake and play out of the bike rack as we head down the road. So that's gonna be our completed look at the Kuat NV 2.0 platform style two bike rack. Part number NV22G on our 2016 Mitsubishi Outlander. First we'll take it onto our slalom course. This will show you the side to side action, such as making turns or evasive maneuvers. Now we're at the alternating speed bumps. This will show you how it looks driving on uneven pavement or potholes. Finally, we're at the solid speed bumps, which simulates going into your driveway or parking lots.